Come to Multinet Design in a continuation of semi data building. In this particular project, we are going to create some of the value of the site. And how do you do that? You create a flower first, flower first around this, and put to where flower is supposed to be. Um, maybe complete the fence and um, probably put the gate. So try to watch the very end at the same time. Subscribe to this channel. So you go to foundation level, that is where we start from, and what we will do is that we we'll use a component model in place. So here we we'll create this work and something we we'll call it grass grassland. So you click that. So what you do now is that you press extrusion to create whatsoever you want to create, and I'm putting here by picking lines. So I'm creating the lines here to focus on what I want to do. So now as I've done this, I'm going to offset by clicking it to like, okay, 200, no, let me use 350, so I'm sorry, 250, so I'm going to use that, I create that space, then close it up. So I do the same thing here as well, despite the fact that okay is um I'm gonna use this one just a little bit to guide that space. Good. So press escape, click finish. So here you change the material category to suit you. So double click on it, say it, just use another one, click and say duplicate with material assets, then rename it to grass. So here you pick up the graphics and say use graphics and then come back and change the material appearance. So go to the asset browser and click on library. So go scroll down and go to site work. From there, you will pick any kind of grass that is suitable to you. You can expand it if you want. Change the top name, whatsoever you will like. Okay, you want to do if it's not big enough. So that's what you do. Then you click here. I'm going to use a dark grass, dark gray. So I'm using picking that as my only. So it's okay for me. I'm going to use that. So now I copy this. I say copy just press one on keyboard that will copy to almost the same spot by now you edit this so editing this one means that you are going to expand this a bit so offset this one by what by 75 so 75 and you without copy so move it outside so that gives you a little bit of space to work with on this thing. So you click finish. You reduce the height to something like 200. Okay, not going to be the same matter. You click on the material here. And you change this material. And you call this one curve. Let's call it curve. So now you finish with it. Change the appearance. Where is the curve? Good. So you select it and change the materials uh, appearance. So go to appearance IB and you just choose any. You can use a wall or side or whatever. Let's choose miscellaneous. So just look at it. Whatever pattern you need that okay is good. I don't see anything I want to use in miscellaneous. Must we? Okay. So I use any of this. I. I don't want it. So just use ceramic. Okay, let me use this in octagon. So I'm going to use this three inches obstacle. I'm clicking that as mine. So check it before you finish the family editor and see whether what you have put in place is yes. So I'm okay with this. This one is okay for me. So I prefer that I'm going to go to this point, go to foundation again, select the whole aspects of what I've created, then I mirror it so it will 
it place itself for that site. So that is it for that area. Now you can now go and get your the other components in place like flowers and things like that. So you come here to machine and sites, choose components and from the components now I have uh, some of this uh, cosmos but I'm not using it for this particular big project. I'm going to use normal rapid uh, components. So yes say click here and whatsoever they give you like this at the refit intensify project. So you choose this you just want to use this America Beach. America Beach has been stated because the reason why all this are big is because of the template I use because my original template just are the thing that are, are there. So you can look at it your own if you have any of yours you can do the same thing. So that's how it's being done. So you can choose material beach and change everything to suit your so I'm using general scrub so I'm going to use this uh, particular mm -hmm. let me use this jungle flame so jungle flame now I'm going to use the change the height to something like 1200 want it more bigger so I'm going to place it here it's like the only one I put there that did not suit my idea I take them off so, so I have them, have them in that manner. So go back to your 3D and go and see before you mirror. Sorry, this is not actually what I want. So go back to your 3D and see what you have put in place before you actually. Now nah, this is it. So this one is okay for you. You can go on and check it from the front elevation. So you open your realistic view and check whether what you have there is what is needed so you see that the originality of the whole design are coming out different uh, effect to different feelings so that is how you design consistently and continue to project and progress so that is what we do here so this is the building so you now can now select all instance select all instance in this view and then you say mirror it suit what you want okay yeah. so the reason why this one is not showing i often used to say to you it's not that it's not there but the mirror under this i've already turned the the in fact the whole image operation so i do encourage you to always do mirror when you are doing uh, when you are doing with the image file like this so all what you just need to do is to do copy and paste. So how do you do that? Control set for that to go. So you select this. You can select this. Select this. No, sorry. Select. 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 So here you do. You just go to foundation where you have them. So you just click copy. Can copy from here to any place you feel like. So you pick it, pick this particular one, put it here. Select this and drag on your mouse. And then you can pick this, these two, and say copy again. You will see that that which you are not seeing at that front is going to be visible this time around. That is the logic. So go back to the south elevation and see that everything is back and back to normal so that is how you do your copy and paste so design are coming out and everything is in surfacing exclusively so what i want to do now i just want to show you some kind of uh, graphics in background so background graphics what you need to do is to click background if you have a sky if you want to use normal sky you can use that and apply you see what you did so this is normal sky that is given to you. So you can decide to hunt the shadow of the shadow, things what you want to do on the the horn, the sun part. Say to continue setting, you can decide to set it the way you want to set it or whatsoever you want to do. And if you don't want it that way, it's less for you. Solar study, things like that are more allowed. So sun setting, 
you can decide to go here and change the relative aspect of it if you know the kind of locality what you are working on so and for that so i'm going to hop that sun setting i don't need it now so for there you go back to the graphics choose this and save sky i always love this is my own best way this is gradient this allows me to decide the kind of color i want my view to look like and every other thing so i'm going to use this particular sky so the grand side i'm leaving in that manner because it looks like a sand so i'm going to give it that so i'm not applying this one now and see what i have so you can imagine the sky is come out with originality things like that so now you can hold your shadow which is on and things like that so all this one if you decide to hide them So that is how you, you work with this and all these things are going to work for your own. So your solar study, like I've said, you can click on it, off it. I don't have anything to do with solar study. I don't need it. So you click there and there we go. So just click here, modify, architecture. Double click again. Mm -hmm. Let's come back to normal. So that's what you need to do. So you have this in place, and everything is done to your own to your own satisfy. So that is the, the beauty of what you have created in this place. So in our next project, we are going to complete this by putting the gates putting the fence and design everything and before we go permanently to render and present so thanks for watching what you just need to do subscribe